Welcome to Soccer Gaming and welcome back to the channel. Welcome back to the gameplay. We are with NCAA Football 25 and I'm going to be doing a KU Jayhawks rebuild. I've already been doing all the recording and stuff. I just need to do all the voiceovers for it. But I also wanted to do something where I kind of started it in NCAA 14, but I just didn't get enough, get a time to go around it. But what we're going to do is we're going to start off as an offensive coordinator somewhere, and we're going to try to get to our alma mater, which is Oregon. So what we're going to try to do is eventually get to be the head coach of the Oregon Ducks. But we are not going to just go there right away. We're going to try to figure out what we're doing here. And what I might do is just, you know, hit Y a couple times and see if they're... Oh, look at that, Oregon. See if there's something I place i want to go but i've already done a online um online randomizer and they actually picked kent state so we're going to be the offensive coordinator at kent state we're the golden flashes in the mac and i honestly think it's and a great now, kind of place to start because start kind of going coach. over everything they're not gear, great but they're also not horrible um so it's kind of the mid of the road coach, i didn't you will be able and i've seen you've seen like the rebuilds with all the the really really bad teams and, and that's fine but i feel like in order for us to actually in order for us to actually kind of enjoy the the coaching experience i don't want to go to a terrible team where we're just like constantly losing and we finish the season one and 12 like that's not really fun so i want to go to a team that's kind of low tier but middle of the road in the low tier so it'll be a little challenging but we will win a few games yes i am playing it on heisman because that's just kind of the only way to play it for me i feel like this is the most realistic if i drop it down to all american i tend to win almost every single game and I don't want this rebuild to be unrealistic so I don't want to go to Kent State and the first year we go 11 and 2 and get into the playoffs or something like that so I wanted to make this as realistic as possible I've played on Heisman in the KU rebuild and I've lost a ton of games so I think it's a more realistic realistic sample size of what to kind of expect realistically so we're going to stay with heisman and we are going to create a coach now, now this coach, coach is i'm not really sure how we want to go about this i i kind of obviously we want the recruiter to be good but we also want to be we also want our players to be good and my thought around this is you're going to have to be able to recruit well so it's like do we want the added bonus of being able to recruit well, or do we want the added bonus of kind of, um, you know, just being good and then hopefully the recruits kind of fall in your lap type of thing. Now, thinking in the future, if we're looking at Oregon, hopefully they're still a top prestige tier team, which means recruiting is going to be easier in the in the end game. So starting out. Is this something we want to mess with? Do we want to be a master recruiter and then get to Oregon and then it's not really that beneficial to us? Do we want to be a motivator? Do we want to have these great pitches and the you know stuff like that? Or do we want to be a tactician? Now, the backstory of this guy, which you see in the top left says select backstory. The backstory of this guy is is a guy who who grew up and Really love football was never big enough, never fast enough to actually play, you know, college football. Now, you know, he played Pee Wee League, he, you know, grew up in the United States, played Pee Wee League, did that type of stuff, but never had the ability to be able to play in, in college. So instead, he stayed at home and he drew up plays. He drew up plays that he thought would be great that one day someone would figure out and this would be this offense, this defense would be the thing that shakes up college football. We're talking like Chip Kelly type of stuff here where he comes in and he just completely changes how the NCAA football is basically ran. I mean, he was running this like. You know, fast, quick pace, come to the line, look at a scorecard or look at a, a card and in the um in the side off the sidelines and then you knew your play and you ran it and so he kind of brought this fast tempo high paced offense to college and he did very he was very very successful with it he also did 
kind of the way the way his offense was ran, you had to be quick. So you had a lot of fast guys on his team. And you know, as as a boy grew up, we wanted to do that. We wanted to have the next big thing in offense. And you know, I feel like as a tactician, we were able to kind of do that, and we we're able we're able to kind of change the way and say football's looked at. And we're going to try to do that with this guy. So we're going in as the tactician and our name, Jackson last name is going to be Jensen. So Jackson Jensen, also known as JJ will be our, our starting example here. And again, we are going alma mater. We are going Oregon. Because Oregon is the end game. Once you get to Oregon, that's it. That you, you've reached you've reached the plateau of what it means to coach. <laughs> Oregon. Boom. Alma mater. There we go. Uh pipeline. Uh can we do is there West Coast? I don't know what. I guess we go Southern California. Adaptive AI. I don't know what that means. No huddle style. Regressive. We run a lot of plays here, okay? That's how we roll. We are we are very aggressive. Not sure what adaptive AI is, but we're just going to be aggressive with everything. So um, our playbook actually is is something, a little something, something I put together myself here. And I don't know if it's in the game. Not sure how that works if you have to. So this isn't the actual playbook. I, I made my own playbook. Um, defensive playbook. I, I really don't know what we want to run, to be honest with you. Um, Mm -mm -mm. Maybe four two five would be good. I feel like there's so many offenses now that run just just pass heavy. That four two five is is something we can get behind. So we're gonna go ahead and do that. Mess with his appearance. We're just gonna do Captain Generic. Boom! There he is. There he is. Now, as I said, we weren't big enough. We weren't talented enough to make it ourselves because we are five nine and currently two hundred pounds. So. Let it be said. And apparel, obviously. Oh, apparently all we got is a shirt. That's all we got. Oh, no, there we go. Come. Come. We're looking fly. Yeah, there he is. There he is looking fly. All right. Let's jump into the rebuild. We are at Kent State as the offensive coordinator, Jackson Jensen. And uh, this could be fun. So Kent State, obviously looking at, at the years past, not the greatest. We've had a couple of years, I guess, 2012. They are 11-3. and three. So that's pretty nutty. Uh, the last couple of years, not so hot. 7-7, seven and 5-7, seven, and 1-11 and seven, last year. Sheesh, didn't even know. Didn't even know, but that's okay. We're taking over a 111 as an offensive coordinator. Now, the whole the whole thing of this is to get to Oregon. Now, I will do my best to try to not go crazy. So, like, if I have a great year at Kent State year two or something, and then I'm offered the head coach of Notre Dame or something, I'm not going to take it. Um, it's just, I feel like it's too big a jump. I'd rather take the offense or I'd rather take the head coach at Northern Illinois or something like that and kind of rebuild up that way. So this isn't going to be like, oh, in year three, I'm going to be, you know, the offense coordinator of Alabama or something like that. Like we're going to build this up from the bottom and, and try to be as realistic as possible. So keep that in mind when we're going through and we're making decisions and you're like, wait, you had, you had the ability to go to to um, Alabama as a head coach, you didn't take it in year four? Well, no, that's not realistic. That's not realistic at all. There's no way Alabama would do that. So let's jump in as the offense coordinator now. When we are offense coordinator, we're not doing recruiting. Uh, the reason being is usually your office coordinator doesn't do a lot of the recruiting. So when we are an office coordinator anywhere, so say we start at Kent State, we go to head coach in Northern Illinois, and then we get an off offensive coordinator job at like Pittsburgh or something like that. And we're like, yeah, let's try to take the offensive uh, offensive coach again. Then we'll turn basically turn recruiting off, not turn it off, but like it'll be auto. I won't do the recruiting. So that being said, when we're going through these, I will not be doing any of the recruiting. I'll let the computer do all of that. I'm basically just taking care of the scheme and the players and like the depth charts on offensive side. And then the rest is up to the team to basically do it. So w when you're an offense coordinator, defense coordinator, whatever, like a lot of a lot of your success comes from the overall arching of the team, not just necessarily you. So we might have an amazing offense, but the defense can't do anything, and you just have to live by it. So 
Let's jump into it. We're not going to really mess with custom schedules. We're going to kind of keep them where they're at, and we're just going to kind of let... Oof, that's a tough start. Tennessee and Penn State? Mm-mm-mm. Doesn't look fun to me, but again, we are going to let the recruiting kind of do their things. We got our first five coins, so let's see what we want to do. So, uh, the, 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 the basis of my offense is you want... I want powerful runners... I want quick, powerful runners. Basically, my everything is going to be based around the running back and tight end. That being said, I obviously want my tight ends to be able to block and catch really well. So, a lot, a lot of my stuff, like you know, option quarterback probably would be kind of the thing we want a, a speedier quarterback so that we can run options and stuff. But ultimately, the run game is is where we're at. That's where we're gonna put most of our stuff. I think that that's probably the the way I want to go with how I want to do it. So we're gonna work on offensive line, running back, uh, the rest of the stuff. I'll wait until I'm actually head coach. But we're definitely gonna be making sure that we are taking care of of the running backs and stuff like that. So our first point goes into the running backs ratings boost. It boosts. Pass, block, and run block. So, that being said, we're jumping into that. And it looks like our defense coordinator, Darren Gardner, is elite recruiter. Okay. And then our head coach, Aaron Watson, is a tactician as well. That's good to see. So, we'll kind of kind of see where we're at. I, to me, recruiting recruiting is a lot more tough on this game than it was in 20, uh, two, yeah, 2014. So... It's it's something that we're going to eventually touch on, but it's not something I want to pursue right now. Like I don't think recruit like I don't think upgrading recruiting right now as offensive coordinator is going to be helpful at all because I'm not even recruiting. So I'd rather I'd rather make my players better and kind of move on from that and we'll probably hit motivator architect along the way or something. I'd rather worry about that than worry about trying to recruit people when I'm an offensive coordinator. When we get to a head coach position, then we can start touching on the on the recruiting and stuff so so we are done with that i'm gonna go over here to the settings you guys can see it's on heisman and i'm actually gonna go down here to auto recruiting and turn it on uh user yeah we'll keep that on so auto recruiting is on we're gonna let the the computer recruit for us and uh, because you know as an offensive coordinator like obviously you do recruiting you reach out to recruits but you don't like set like it's like you go in and be like hey guys as the offensive coordinator i want a five-star quarterback go out and make it happen you know you know what i mean whereas like a head coach is like okay this is how i want to build the program this is what we're going to do and then you bring in the offensive coordinators and defense coordinators that you feel like will fit your scheme um so as an offense coordinator, we are brought in to run the way the head coach wants to run, but also with our little extra stuff to it. But basically, all the head coach is up. It's up to the head coach to get the recruits that we need to be able to run the offense. So uh, no recruiting for us. So we'll head to next week. I don't know how long these will be. We'll just kind of roll with it and see, um, you know, see how things go and kind of go from there because I have no idea what to expect um, as far as like how long these episodes are going to be and it's because I'll, I'll, I'll make the episodes probably around 20 ish minutes 20 20 30 minutes in between there. We'll we'll run the episodes for that long. So we'll kind of just roll with that by week We go in Look at us. Look at us losing commits. Boom easy All right, our first game versus a Pittsburgh clearly outmatched. That's fine. So we got heart. We got determination so before we get started, let's take a look and see what we got for depth chart. Kind of go from there as well. Probably head coach will probably be ahead or probably be the person to redshirt people. So I'm not going to mess with that. Uh, depth chart though. I'm going to say we have kind of control on that as an offense coordinator. And this all looks good to me. Actually, I'll do that. Okay, running backs are slow. That's not good. This guy's okay though. Agility, strength, not very high though. Well, I have to see. Make it work. We'll make it work. Wide receiver. Got one fast wide receiver. He's weak though. 48 strength. Love to see that. A lot of seniors. Oof. 
Oof. So hopefully we recruit well, because that's not looking good. Tight ends. Okay, we need to have some good tight ends. We have uh, two okay seniors. It's not great. Oof. Yeah, we might be in trouble here. Senior, oof. Yeah, we're, it's looking like we're dropping next year. We'll see. We'll see. It could be rough, but we'll have to, we'll have to see in game one here what we come up against and what we can do against Pittsburgh. Right. Kent State. Let's get it. I'm in the macaroni. So they got, is this how they have you picked? Maybe. No, probably not. Cause Toledo's probably at the top. Anyway, I don't know. We should be, yeah, we, we should probably run here. I would say top five. Top five is what we're shooting for here. Cause it, it's going to be rough. I'm not going to lie. It's going to be very rough cause the team isn't great. And the, the team that is good is a lot of seniors. So it's going to, next year's going to be rough. That's fine. That's why I play him. Right? So again, we're not messing with the recruiting 350 points. Ouch. That's going to be rough. That's going to be really rough. Anyway. All right. Offense coordinator for Kent State. Let's jump into it. We are playing Pittsburgh Panthers at Pittsburgh. And we are running the Kansas offense so far. First, uh, yeah, we want to kick with the win. All right, cool. Let's get it started, Kent State. All right, let's jump into it. We got the ball first. It is a rowdy in pit. Feeling a rowdy. All right, we want to come out here. We we need to get the run started. If we want any chance at winning this game, we got to get the run started. Got to give Garcia the ball early and, and quick. So the biggest part of this offense is going to be getting our playmakers the ball in space and it's going to be making quick passes you know like letting them make plays we're not going to try to go deep we just said we don't have the players we don't have the skill set we don't have the, the quarterback with the arm we just got to get those easy plays we got to get those two three yard you know routes or whatever and let them make plays but we got to get the running game started here so so far so good here a lot of a lot of RPOs are going to be useful with this type of offense. They're going to ride the big fella. He's such a stud. They're going to build the offense around him. This is just game one, but you're going to get a lot of big runs from this guy. And the defense knows him. I'm ready. A pretty good start here. You know, as a defense, pretty good start here. Now this is on Heisman. Remember, remember, this is on Heisman. This is where we got to make plays, though. Is this this uh, third and three? Third and three is uh, we got to make plays here. Hopefully Brown. If you see if he sets down on the zone, it's a zone, right? I'm almost positive it's a zone here. Maybe not. We'll see here in a second, depending on what Floria does. Perfect. There. Catch it. Catch it. Oh, you got to hold on to that, bro. Come on. All right. All right. We're going for it. We're going for it. This is a point where you just got to be able to focus. The critical down and distances in this game, like that third down right there. When it's a good throw, you got to make the catch. You got to be able to make to make that play, though. All right, Junker. Junker. Come on. Come on, Junker. He still doesn't know what's going on, bro. All right. Floria might be hit early here. 
There he is. There he is. Catch that. There we go. Perfect job, guys. Perfect job there. Wait, we didn't get it? What? Did we not get that? Am I crazy? That's a first down and he caught it, right? Am I out of my mind? Boom. He's in. Am I missing something? Hell yeah. I was going to say, I, I don't think he did. What a challenge by the offensive coordinator. Little Jackson Jensen telling that head coach, hey, yo, you got to throw that flag, my guy. Come on now. Where do I want to be moved to? Here, maybe. Let's see. Oh, 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 run, 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 throw. Sheesh. Could have been bad. They're coming hardcore on me. Third and nine. All right. Kind of stuck in a, we don't want, we don't want third and long. Third and longs are not good. We just don't have, we just don't have the playmakers to make this happen. We might as well just get help here. We'll do full slide to the right. Okay. Ready? Back to throw. It's Gubatowski. Oh, catch that, catch that, catch that. Let's go. That's big. What a play. Woo. He's run out of bounds. Okay. Okay. Let's go, offense. I see you. Sheesh. Come on now. Come to the line with a fresh set of downs. Oh. Oh, beautifully blocked. Junker could hold on to that a little bit longer. But honestly, I mean, I can't complain. I cannot complain. Okay, third and two. Right where we want to be. Right where we want to be. Get in there, big dog. Oh, I don't even know who he is, but put that crown on. Let's go. Crown him. He's the champ. Big man. That was a big juke. And that was a beautiful first drive, creating some momentum, not only for this offense. Watch him do his thing. Oof. Oof. Three needs new soles on those shoes after that juke. He's new shoe soles. Because that, that shoe just lost its soul. That's what happened there. It's that. Why was it so slow? Am I, am I doing something wrong here? It's Heisman. Why was it so slow? That was weird. Why am I, why am I doing these moments? Is considered offense? Just take a knee in this drive. We'll start at the 25. <sighs> Let's presume. Play options. Only want to play offense. Thank you. All right. Defense couldn't hold him. Here we go. All right. It's all right. I mean, we know we got to put up a lot of points. It's just, can we? I mean, that's honest truth. Ah, should have. Mm. Bring him down, and he's going to lose a yard on that one. Well, there's a statement by the defensive line. First down. Let's try to get a chunk here. And they just dominated up front. Beat their one on one. Should work. Force a tackle for a loss. There it is. There it is. There it is. Get it, Garcia. Let's go. Drop the hammer on him. For the first down. Here's this offense with a fresh set of downs. The give to the back. Ooh. 
Big dog. Smack him with a hammer. Ooh, we'll get the first down. We'll take that. Good first quarter. Good first quarter. Hey, I'm happy about that. Good first quarter. All righty. All right, here we go, offense. Keep it going here. Garcia is just the, the workhorse here. All right, this could be a big play here. Could be a big play here. There it is. Give it to him. To him. Let him go. Here we go. Got to give the ball out in space to playmakers here. And that's just a great individual effort by the wide receiver. He catches this ball way short of the sticks, but because he's able to make the defender miss, now he's able to get the extra yards and turn that into an explosive play. Oh, ran right into the big guy. the tackle after he gets two down to the 25. Hate to see that. Hate to see that. Probably gonna be covered here. We'll see. If he comes on the blitz, we're good though. No. Oh, get it, Garcia. Keep giving up boy to rock. Ah, I don't know if this will work. Yeah, I figured they're gonna pack the area. Let's go left on this. Go left on this. Uh oh. Uh oh. Where'd all our blockers go? All our blockers went night night. They said, mm, doesn't seem like a good block to me, boys. They left. I'm not sure what to do here, honestly. Let's go with this. See what they do. If we can get it outside, we should be good. Hopefully the blocks inside hold. There we go. Ooh, get it, Thomas. Alrighty. See if they go out on Thomas here. He's really gonna be the guy we go after. Uh, looks like they're running zone on this, so this won't work. Let's go inside zone. Yeah. Let's try a little touch pass here, see if we can get out in space. Should work. Looks like they're running man on it. There we go. All right. All right. Chunker, maybe. Let's see what this does. Let's do Garcia. Let's go with Garcia back. Because we could we could get some um, rubbing action in there and get some people open, so let's do that. To the air, it's Gubatowski. There it is. Beautiful job, guys. Great blocking up front by the big guys. Whew. Keep working it. O line. Sheesh, maybe Kent State's the real deal, guys. He might, they might be the real team. He's going to have a good career. Well done. Let's go. We got the ball back. I like that. Oh, okay. like this field position. All right. If those guys come down, we're going to Junker all day. Oh. No, 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 no. Oh, Garcia, the little speed boost. He's feeling it. He's feeling the upset coming today. He says, folks, we won one game last year. Ain't no way that's happening this year, buddy. All right, Floria might be one-on-one -on, -one on that corner. He'll be our first guy we go to, and then we'll probably just drop it down to Brown if he's not open. Let's move the pocket to the right. I want to make sure that we're not getting yanked on the right side with Floria over there. Floor is open. Oh, but the pass isn't there. Pass was not there. That's all right. That's what happens when your quarterback's not the greatest in the world. We're gonna get things like that happening. See if we can get some some chunk here with Garcia. Ooh. 
Nope. Could make my mind on that if I wanted to go in or out or what. So McCray, I don't think he'll be open. We're probably hitting Batten on the down low. Uh, let's do Junker the other way. Let's see what happens there. No. Let's roll out. Uh, give him a chance. Have to give him a chance. All right, let's take the field goal. Let's take the field goal. There we are. Let's go. 17-7. We'll take that. We'll take that all day. So they're able to score. No extra point. We got two minutes to go down the field and score here before half. Oof. That wasn't good. Really nobody open though either. There's really nothing I can do about that. Let's hit him with the base and see. Batten could be. Floria could be. Craig could be. Dude, they do have the safety over the top, though. Let's get the yards. Let's get the yards. All right. This will be the make or break, break play. This will either keep the drive going or we'll punt it. Junker might be open because Floria should clear that guy out. A safe deal go over the top of McCray. So Junker should be open here about the 40-yard line. The question is, can we make the play last that long? On third down, he drops the throw. There it is. The oh, hold on to the ball. Let's go. Woo, let's keep it rolling. That was a big. Big, right where I told you, the 40. All right. Dropping back. There we go. Take what they give you. Take what they give you. Ooh, get him, Garcia. Alright, we'll try to open this baby out. We'll pop Garcia here in the flat. All right, we'll take that. All right. Let's try a screen here. Not run a screen yet. If we could get a pretty decent chunk here. Actually, I think they're doing zone here. We'll see. Flip it. Get him, Garcia. We'll take it. We'll take it. Batten will probably be who we go here for. Let's do Thompson over here, though, just in case. Yeah, if you're going to have success when you throw it outside like that, you're going to need some more blocking and better blocking down the field. Give the defense credit, though. There it is. Get out there. Woo! There he goes. Batten down the hatches, baby. Woo! Now this offense building that lead. It's still the first half, but I'll tell you what, shown some glimpses of why they could become a really coming out as the Kingsman this year, folks. Put that put that crown on. Batten down the hatches. There he is. Ooh. Man. What a big opportunity there. Ah, oh, and then we give up oh no, we gave up the defenses. Defense is absolute poopy, dude. All right. Got to make some plays here in the second half. Make some plays here in the second half. Get in there. Oh. This is going to be their big play to Junker. Or let's see what they do. This should be a pretty big play here. Nope, 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 nope. Oh, he still makes it work. Get it, Junker. Woo! Keep moving it, baby. The big thing with this Kent State team is you can't do anything cute. It just won't work. We just have to stay stay with the tried and true and keep rolling it. If we try something cute, like some sort of, like, you know, reverse or something like that, it's going to blow up in our faces. So we can't do stuff like that. Uh, I'm, I'm not sure this is going to work, but we'll give it a try. Give it a try. There it is. Oh, beautiful. Oh, what a beautiful pass. A plus. A plus. All right. They know we're going to run, so we're going we're gonna to slash him again with the baton. 
or the baton. This guy's like name can be used for everything. Oh. All right. Going forward is what we want to do. Light him up, baton. It's not going to be open though. No. They're going to test oh. the right side with this one. Really nice stop there from this senior okay. leader. Third and manageable. It's exactly what we want. Let's do Junker underneath here. We're not going deep on this stuff. Play in zone, I believe. The corner is way too far outside. So Floria might pop in that zone if Bat if Batten takes off the top. We'll see. Those are our two options. Nope, it wasn't. We'll just take that. Let's go. Let's go. Uh, wrong RPO side. Oh, Batten's gonna get a huge gain here. Here it comes. Here it is. One on one. Got him. Batten's just built different, guys. Just built different. Two over there. We'll see what they do. It's a zone. We're good. We we should be good here. Yep, there it is. Oh. GG's. Well done, guys. And then let's try this. This might be a touchdown for Junker. Could be. Might also not be. Mm. We'll see. Ooh, they're ready for it now. They're ready for it there, and the blocking wasn't there. Which is the main thing. All right, this should work. We should be fine here. Is McCray? McCray can hold his block long enough. We should be fine. Get in there. We're running it two times in a row. I just got to figure out what plays we're doing here. Let's try this one. No, nope, this ain't going to work. Get in there. Get in there. Ah, no way. Ain't no way. Do we do a simple read option? Like, is that the play? Oh, direct. There we go. We found it. We found it. We're going in. Should be fine. Should be fine. Should be fine. Get in there. What are you doing? Damn, wrong hole. Oh, that was big, man. That was really big. Where did we mess up there? I felt like I got sucked in there. I just couldn't get anywhere. I couldn't go outside. Ah, oh, that's such a missed opportunity. I'm glad they didn't do anything with it. Oh, that hurts, man. That hurts. All right, it's all you, Garcia. Run, buddy, run. Run, Garcia, run. Good pick up on that play. It'll bring up second and four. All right, probably Floria here. Could be bat baton. We'll see. There he is. Perfect. Boom, just like that. Just like that. New set of downs after that completion. Really nice job on that play. Quarterback and receiver being on the same. Page. Oh, you got to get that block. 70. Come on now. That's a, you got to get that block, buddy. It's got to be a block. Oh no. <laughs> Oh, there's so much room. Oh, man. That was GG's. There is so much room there. All right. If he comes down, Holden. He did not. Oh, Brown. We go for these. No 
I'm not confident in this play, but we're going with it anyways. No, that was a. It, mm, he was wide open, and I go to throw it him, and he moves. The pain. The pain. He was literally open for an hour and a half, standing over there. Oh no! They won't even show me the replay yet. They're like, you don't want to see this, dude. Oh no! Oh no! Oh no! Oh, no. <sighs> the pain. All right, we have another chance. So you're saying there's a chance. How many times can we screw this up? We've had two opportunities in a row now to get, get points. Either time. Oh, Garcia, put the, plant that foot in the dirt. Let's go. RPO game's where it's at right now. They are not covering the run on this. Do we direct it again and risk it? Yeah, let's try it. Oh, this should work. I should be able to get out to the outside here pretty quick. As long as 77's ready. There it is. There it is. Let's go. All right. Well, they came into this game today knowing that this guy was going to have to leave his mark. Let's bubble it. The There's so much time here. I don't know why they think we should just run, 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 run. This might be good, though. There it is. 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 Oh! This was not quick enough out of that split. Split was too long. All right. First down here. That's what we're worried about. We just need to get a field goal position. We don't need to go crazy. We don't need to score in a certain amount of time. We just need to get into the field goal range. But we can't waste too much time because if we don't, then we're basically giving up the game. So it's like a double-edged sword here. Ah, this probably isn't going to work. Let's just hit it with the run. Oh, and its own guy got in his way. Hate to see it. Hate to see it. All right, we're doing a little bit of play action pass here. We're going to be hitting our junker over here, over the middle here. If he can get separation from the from the linebacker, we should be good. Whether or not he does that or not is another thing. It's not. But we got some room. We got some room here. We'll take that first down. We'll take that first down. All right, two-minute warning. Oh, okay, big drive here. Big drive here. I'm in the driver's seat. All right. Bubble time. Not liking what I see so far. It's going to be a run here. Oh, get out there, Garcia. Let's go. Garcia's having a sneaky good game. Really solid game from Garcia. All right, first down, they think we're running here. The Craig could be open, but it's not a throw we want to make unless we have to. Probably hit Brown here in the middle. Actually, we're switching to run. There's way too much room on that left side. There's way too much room on that left side to not run. Boom, just like that. Let's go, baby. Woo! Run him up. Run him up. Right away after picking up the first down, they go right back to their playmaker at running back. And I love the push they got up um, getting a hat on a hat, opening a huge Let's go with a little slip screen. I feel like you can't really screw up. I mean, you can, but it'll just be a loss. It won't be, like, catastrophic, hopefully. Of course, if that linebacker, if the mic comes up, we're hitting baton really easy, really early here. Nope. Ooh, get outside. Here we go, Garcia. All right, we're running now. We're rolling. Conservative. Um. 
just a perfectly how do we want to do this we'll just inside zone it for now if 73 can cut the edge there 87 hits the the line gap there we're good there it is edge set perfect Ooh, just as you draw it out baby Hey, remember, not doing anything crazy. Nothing crazy. We'll put in the a, a little uh, RPO here because if they're straight up blitzing, Baton's going to be so open. It's be dumb not to throw it to him here. Second and two. We got 40 seconds left. We won't want to get pit too much time. We're already at field goal range. Now, field goals in this game are never guaranteed. So, okay. Let's see what happens here. Nope, we're keeping it. We're keeping it. We're keeping it with Garcia. Now, we do have to be careful because Garcia, earlier, we were not able to get it in with Garcia. So, it is something we got to be careful with. What do they have right now? Oh, this jet pass is going to be pretty good. Yep, yeah, we're going to be good. We're going to be golden here. As long as McCray can make his block, we should be golden here. Sign. Perfect. Get in there. Get in there. Let's go. What a run. What a run. Offensive line holding in there. All right. Great job. All right, defense. It's up to you to hold them, buddy. Can the defense do it? I think they did. It can see. Pulls the upset. And for the first week, they get it done. Great start to the season. That's what you want. You want to come out, find a way to win. Was it perfect? Absolutely not. You're going to find things to work on throughout the season. But 1-0, and that's where you wanted to be. And I think if you're the coaching staff of this winning team, you've got to like what you've just seen. First game of the year, there was tremendous effort on the field. Guys flying around, flying to the football, trying to make the plays necessary to win this game. They definitely made a few mistakes, but that's what practice is for. But if you're the coaching staff, I think you're very, very positive right now moving forward. That's going to do it for us. I mean, you got to be happy with that, right? I mean, what a game to start out. What a game. It doesn't get much better than that. I mean, no turnover. Well, we had a turnover, right? We threw an interception. Yeah. I mean, you can't be mad about that. Cannot be mad about that. So, what, ran 70 plays? All right. Yeah, you can't be mad about that. What a great game. What a great complete game. Woo! Love it. Olatowski. Player of the game. Three touchdowns. 220 through the, through the air. Garcia, what a madman. What a madman. Then Thomas came and did his thing. Kai Thomas from Topeka, Kansas. Yeah, what a good game. Just all around. All around good game there. Love it. Love it. Well done, boys. Got the first dub of the year already in week one. Well, week two technically, but... I mean, can't be really mad about that. That's a big, I mean, that's a big win. Really big win. Really big win there. Week one versus Pitt. Pitt didn't have what it took, man. I'll tell you what, they just didn't have what it takes. Oh, look at this, getting commits. Ooh. Good old machete. Coaching prestige. Yeah, I got some guys wanting to leave. McCray leaves. We're effed. Nice. Well done. All right. FCS team should be a much easier week going into it. But I think we just load up the offensive line, right? Like the, uh, the offensive lines are lifeblood. I mean, we got to. They're their lifeblood, man. You got to load them up. Have to. All right. Okay. Um, I'm not sure where we're at in the recording. 
but we might actually just end up doing this week by week and I'll just release these as quick as possible because I almost feel like this is like the perfect amount of time between games. So yeah, we got we got the defense, but not the offense. Tucker Gleason, bro, just balled out. Oh yeah, he did. Five TDs, 332 through the game. Yeah, GG's to him. He deserved it. All right, so yeah, that's going to do it for week one. Um, next episode, week two, we're playing FCS East and don't really need to look at their team because, I mean, they're probably not great. But again, we got to stay with our game plan. We got to just keep running the rock, keep grinding them down. That's how we do it. Thank you guys so much for watching this episode. If you enjoyed it, make sure you give it a big thumbs up. Also, feel free to hit that red subscribe button. I will see you guys in the next one with the Kent State Golden Flashes.